Ground ball right side. How able to glove it at second and get the out at first. This coaching staff has opted to try and, and do it with two years. Kulak gets the strikeout. Wazikowski likes to try and move those runners as Hunter able to get on here. Skyler Hunter with the first hit of the day. The 3-2. Strike three. And a 1-2 count. And he strikes out Clay Dungan. Two consecutive strikeouts from 1-2. Strike three. As Dungan goes down looking for the second time today. Beard keeping the Sycamores off the board in the top of the fourth. Purdue. Line drive into center. This one drops. Fascia around second. This goes all the way to the wall. Zach Fascia around third. He's being waved home. How? Into third base. A triple for the freshman. Well, he made an error early. This one up in the air. Foul territory. Third base side. Fascia combining with Powers. I'm not sure which one got it. I think it was Tyler Powers. Leaning over to make the catch, ranging from third base. One hit by pitch, and that was the only runner in that top of the fifth for Indiana State. For Indiana State, Evan Giles. This one put back into left. It's going to drop for a base hit. Powers around first, he'll stay there. As Tyler Powers motors it down around first base, and Purdue is locked in as he would like it to be. Here's the 3-1, and Sage jams that out to right field, and it's down. Powers into score. Johnny Sage around first, and into second safely. Johnny Sage ties it up at two. This one back into right field as McKenzie has to go back for it and makes the catch heading towards the track in right center. Go down with the bat on the shoulder. He's going to come after it. And Thomasick gets him. <laughs> right as you called it, partner. Indiana baseball history means, uh-oh, that's going to be down the line and left. Could be trouble. This is Sage right on the line as he's able to get to it. Then all the way across the field to double up Clay Dungan at first. What a hose. I'm not even sure that that made it to the plate. I think that bounced in the dirt. There goes the Powers. Plate. Throw from right. Little high. And Powers stays on the base after an errant throw. So now the dial moves up one click as the pressure starts to mount on Ridgeway with one out here in the seventh. Few people enjoy putting the pressure on in the base running like Wazikowski. We've seen... Saw Purdue a couple of times last year steal home in these situations. I'm not saying that that's what they're going to do here, but you know they won't be afraid to let Powers kind of inch down the line. Here's the 3-2. Fly ball back into center. This is Fagan. He already threw out somebody at home, and Fagan drops it. Powers scores easily. Jack Swing, Fascia on the drop third to first in time to beat out. Johnson with the 0-2, and he struck him out. Another drop third. Fascia to first in time. Indiana State gets a run back here in the eighth. We are tied. 2-2. Swung on and missed. A huge K for Tyler Ward. Again out on the mound, and there's a base hit from Howe. That's As the freshman starts it off for Purdue. It's the start you need if you're Purdue. You gotta 